Yeah, so those three things we need are the height, the width, and the sliding direction of the screen door. Okay, so we're gonna start off with the width first. That's measuring from the inside of this channel to approximately center of here, usually 36, 48, or 60 wide. And Steve will do that now. So first of all, there's a pocket here. You wanna go all the way in the pocket. So it's roughly 35 and a half, 36 would work. You usually don't want to go too wide and the door won't overlap properly and you'll have a gap. So on this door we'd go 35 and a half on the width. And now we'll do the height. The height is measured from the top of this inside track down to the top of this track the rollers go on. And we're going to need three measurements. Here, the center beam of the door, and then the far right or far left. So we'll start here on the lock side, far right, all the way up to the top of the track. Kind of gauge how tall. We want to make sure we can clear. We don't want the door to be too big, otherwise it won't go in. So according to my measurements, on this side, the door is about 77 and 3 fourths of an inch tall. You always want to check the middle. That's where you get settling, so the height of the door might be a little smaller in the middle, which would make it not fit if you were to use a side measurement. This one's obviously a little shorter in the middle, so on this one I'd go 77 and a half. So obviously there's a half quarter inch difference between the ends and the center, and you always want to use the smaller size rather than the larger size. It's always good to measure all three. It's all size. A little wider on the end. So that's basically it. Now we want to make sure that the door slides the same way as the sliding door does. Obviously, this door slides from the inside to the left, from the outside, slide to the right. That's where we'd want this screen door to go. Yeah, so those three things we need are the height, the width, and the sliding direction of the screen door. The height being from the top of this track to the bottom of that track, left, middle, and right. The width being center of this beam to the edge of the door. Those are those two are the important things. The last item obviously would be the direction of the slide from the outside. Handle on the left, handle on the right.